This is Sarah Torse playing Chrono Cross, and today we're, um, we're going to continue through this Terra Tower. Um, I'm going to pick up some of those chests that I missed, because I'm a dumbass, but luckily we dropped those uh, columns down so we can go back, if I can remember. The way to go back now. I think it was this way, but I can't really be sure. Yeah, it was. Okay. Uh, wait, how did I... No, no, no. I had, uh... Damn it. I'm trying to think it was, like... No, I had to been this way because I came out... And I knocked it down from over here. So it has to be this way. Okay, I'm an idiot. Sorry. I just, uh... Don't like missing treasure chests. It annoys me. So we beat that guy in here, and the dog's barking really loud. Great. Oh, we haven't fought one of these guys yet, so let's see if these guys are like... <sighs> Damn dog. I don't even know if you guys can... It picks it, the mic picks it up. Sometimes it does, sometimes it doesn't. I don't know. Hopefully it doesn't. <laughs> Alright, um, these little guys are cupoids. Oh, damn it. I forgot to heal kid. I knew I was going to. Hopefully they don't kill kid, but they probably will. The music here is creepy, isn't it? Oh god damn it. Really? Yeah, let's see. I oh yeah, I did see that before. All right, let's see that on kid. Um, yeah, I mean, I don't know <laughs> what to say really. Uh, these, I mean, they're all white elemental, so if you have a black knight in here, it might be strong, but not defend. Do you know how many stamina I should have? burn him then. After he's already been burnt. That's nice. Double burn. Um, I'm gonna start uh, my Final Fantasy V uh, playthrough tomorrow, actually. I'll upload the first episode. So that'll be fun. Um, nice to get back to something 2D, you know. Um, I don't know how many of those I'm going to upload a week, though. I'll upload two of these right now. And I'm going to upload that one in between, so maybe, like, just twice for that, too. I don't know. It just depends on how much time I have to record, so. Yeah, it was this way, wasn't it? Wait, how the hell did we... I'm very confused. How did we end up here? Because I thought... Well, fuck it, I don't care now. <laughs> nope, don't care now. I, I was going to get those chests that I missed, but I don't even know how to go back to where I was before, so it's probably because I'm just missing something, but maybe, I don't know. But I know we can't, we didn't drop into this room or something, so, whatever. This room, I like this place, it looks really cool here. It's like, oh shit, I don't want to fight that guy. No, God, I'm on the fucking ladder. Ugh. I love the music doesn't even, like, because that's what I like, like, the battle music is different in some places, and it doesn't change the, um, like, the music doesn't stop, it just keeps going when you're in battle. I think that's pretty cool. Um, yeah. Come on. Oh, damn it. She doesn't do a lot of damage, physically. 
But she has Pilfer, so that's why I use her, if you wanted to know. And she has those recharges. Um, so, those are really helpful to get you, you know, really strong elements back after you use them. So. Alright. And you can even recharge like Pilfer and use it again if you miss, which is pretty nice. So. Okay. I can't believe you on the ladder, though. Alright, so... Okay, I thought I could go down there. It looks like I can, but... I guess not. Alright, let's go down this ladder and get this chest. What is it? Cool. Don't want to miss those. When it gets made, you don't want you know, because then if you miss those, it's like... Because they're, you know, they're hard enough to get in the first place, and then you don't... Ah, well, I thought I... I'm running into every, I've run into every bad guy that I've seen so far. And these guys are like, they shouldn't be that hard to dodge, but I wasn't even, I thought I wasn't even touching them, but apparently I was. Uh, no, come on. I fucking mi- <sighs> This is annoying. Oh, never mind. Are you fucking... I should've just ran. The whole episode's gonna be me running into these battles, because it's like, already been like, what, ten minutes, and I've only done was fight three guys. We haven't gone anywhere. Went through like one room. Yeah, that's cool. Bitches. Use this since he missed the first one. So you guys have high agility, which is fucking annoying. But I don't think it works. Uh, you need something else for magic to dodge magic attacks. Uh, I don't think you can. I don't even know if you can dodge magic attacks. I don't, even, I don't think we ever have, have we? Huh. Anyway. <laughs> Jesus fucking hell. These damn battles. Alright. Uh, there's. They're all over the goddamn place. How are you supposed to dodge these guys? Because, like, all they do is run, walk in this circle path, and there's nowhere else to... See? I, I was on the fucking ladder, and they still can get me. I'm just gonna run. And go up the ladder. See if that works. I'm not fighting every single one of these fucking guys. It's a pain in the ass. Yeah, just stand there looking stupid. Okay. Yeah, 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 come on. Oh, yeah, it does work. Okay, cool. I want that church just down there, so... I'll have to wait a minute. Ah, oh, how? I just... The perspective, I can't... I'm just sucky at it. Damn it. Alright, it's right from this guy. Come on. See, I, like, it's annoying that it takes so long to load just so you can click run away. I don't know. That's something I think is, like, shouldn't they ask you if you want to run away before they go through all the trouble of loading the entire, you know, arena and everything? I don't know. I just feel like they should. Spectral Club. Okay, cool. I'll wait till he comes back and see if I can walk, you know what I mean, like, around, like, if I can get in front of him and run. And maybe I can get around him. Yeah, no. God damn it. Let me just fight this one because I'm not going to be able to run away. Because if I go up the ladder, I'm just going to run into him again, so. Oh, Jesus. Guys look creepy. They're closed eyes. Like, they look like. Oh, this is weird. They really do look like babies, you know. Overall, I guess. Yeah. 
Yeah. I think, what is kids level 7 tech? I haven't, we haven't even used it yet, have we? Here, let me go see what it is. Unless we kill him. <laughs> and we'll see. Might. I like those moves. Looks, it looks, it looks so cool. Alright. Um. Hot shot. Alright, let's see. Oh, that's nice. Just a gun. That's pretty cool. Yeah. That fight was worth it, because that was pretty cool. I think, I think it was pretty cool. Fifteen hundred gold every time you kill these guys, like, you really need more gold, but... I guess it's there. Spectral Glove. I don't even know who's... Those are like, those are the glove moves, right? So... Or... I don't know why I said glove moves, but people that use gloves instead of... Um... Ah, oh, damn it. Ah, oh, damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. I just want to get away from these guys. They're not my friends. Oh, and you have to go all the way the fuck around. Oh, that's great. Yeah, they're dicks. Get away from me. Holy heat. Yeah, okay. Uh, let me equip that. Restores all HP and removes status effects. See? So I think that's really good. So you want to pick that up. Alright, get the hell out of here. Oh, damn it. Ooh, sneak. Oh, damn it. And there's another thing down there I need to go get. So, I need to just go back. Gosh. Gosh dang. I should have got that one first, huh? Alright. I've been dodging these guys pretty good, though. Another rainbow shell, okay. Uh, these guys are like, bunched up at the end. No, they're, but where are they at? Oh god. This part seems harder to dodge them for some reason. What? I just, I walked through his body, okay. He's a ghost, I guess. <laughs> I don't mind. Yeah, I'll deal with that, that's fine. Oh. Could this be? Five of mana? What's going on? I, I don't know, kid. Oh look at the like the the fade effect. It's pretty cool. Uh, oh look, there's Chrono, and there's um. What what the hell? What's going on here? Hey, you. Da 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 da. I don't like that. That seems scary. Wait, who, wait. it's the guy at time, isn't it? Um. Welcome. It's good to see you finally made it here. I've been expecting you, Surge. Well, that hardly is this Viper Manor. This is a space that doesn't exist, but don't mind that. More importantly, I have something I must explain to you. Oh, jeez. Who are you? Oh, my name is Balthazar. In the ancient magical kingdom of Zeal, I was known as the Sage of Reason. Well, that was up until the Queen of Zeal attempted to harness the power of Lavos. Just think got out of control, and Lavos created a dimensional vortex that threw me far into the future. <laughs> there I seized the opportunity to study the science of the future. I was unable to apply that knowledge I brought from my own era, including magic, which was long lost in the future. Anyway, this led me to make huge progress in the research of time. Well, that research led to the creation of, the Chron of Chronopolis and the time crash. You might think I really blew it, but perhaps it was really my finest hour. Ho ho ho. Yeah. Hour. I get it. Anyway. I created a compact time machine that I dubbed the Neo Epoch. I used it as a time warp to this age to learn of Chronopolis and Fate's plans and see how things were turning out. Well, not well, are they? Terra Tower is really the city of uh, reptites from another dimension's future. It was originally Dinopolis, the castle of Azala's descendants who achieved the evolution and much more intimate with our planet. Dinopolis was drawn into this dimension's past about 10,000 years ago. 
This was done that it served as a counterbalance against Chronopolis, which Lava was pulled here. Oh, okay. Interesting. Needless to say, a fierce battle ensued. In the end, Chronopolis emerged as the victor, and Reptite's fortress was sealed away by fate. Yeah. Cool. I guess. <laughs> But more important now is the world of the dragons plate and all of this. Originally, the whole Ar uh, I hate this word. archipelago of El Nido was known as the Sea of Eden. This was because it was where the dragon gods resided. But then fate sealed away the dragon gods' powers, in effect becoming a god itself. Thus, the islands where the new god had fate in existence came to be called the Sea of Eden instead. Perhaps you didn't realize it, but you were used by the dragon gods to eliminate fate. It was not true that the dragon gods sealed away the frozen flame. But it's quite the opposite. It was fate that used the power of the flame to steal up the dragon gods. In reality, the dragon gods were the opposition to man, while fate itself was actually the protector of humanity. Yeah, no, I got that. I thought we were fighting him so we could, like, defeat that guy. <laughs> the dragon gods were originally a singular plasma life form, a living accumulation of the planet's energy. Originally, it was the biological machine used to control the powers of nature in the future society of the reptites. In order to control the natural energy itself, fate divided one dragon god entity into six weaker plasma life forms, then scattered them across the land and sealed them away. Their dragon like appearances are just pseudo guises, temporary forms they take so they can appear in this dimension. But all that changed when fate was vanquished and as power hold was eliminated. At that moment, the seven dragons, who had been rendered almost powerless and forgotten, traveled across the dimensions to reunite into a single entity. Seven dragons? I thought there were only six. There were six dragons you knew of, and one more hidden dragon you didn't. Like the second moon that was once lost, but later was found. Although the same planet, my world didn't have two moons. Look up at the night sky, and you would not see seven celestial bodies. Five stars and two moons. Wait, one of those moons is the goddamn dragon, isn't it? Five brother stars that correspond to the five colored dragons ruling like gods over the night skies. One moon that corresponds to the white sky dragon, another darker daughter moon to counterbalance them. The fire dragon, the water dragon, the green dragon, the earth dragon, the black dragon, the sky dragon, and one more, the final dragon, the dark moon dragon, the one who was to work to free the other dragons from their bondage by the fate computer. The child the others created in the night of an electric storm that temporarily caused fate to loosen its hold on them. Wait. I believe you knew her as Harley. What? She was a dragon god the whole time? Unbelievable. I know, right? The dragon gods were the essence of nature on this planet. Perhaps we can consider what's happening as our planet's vengeance on us. To finally sweep away the unwanted humans from the face of this blue planet. First it was fate. Now it's the planet. Or vice versa. But either way you look at it, now is the time to set things right. The future of mankind, the destiny of this planet, everything depends on the next battle you will fight. Oh yeah? So do I have to kill. But unfortunately the time for us to part has come. Uh, okay. Hey mister, is that the Chrono Cross you guys have there? Yeah. The Chrono Cross. The melody and harmony. To part across space and time and unify people's thoughts and feelings. Power to transfer memories. Huh. By using it as an element, it has the power to draw on the sounds of the six colored elements to produce a healing harmony. It has the power to combine the sounds of the world into one melody. Wish we'll meet again soon, in one time period or another. Be careful now, then good luck. Okay, great. Alright, uh, I guess now that we do have all that exposition, how do you do this? Was it over here? I need to get that thing. It was it, it, This blue thing just makes me think, but no, it's not. Um, we need to drop that ladder down. I forget what. Isn't it like one of these books or something? I forget. And I can't turn towards them. And there it is. The switch. 
Push it. Okay. Right, let's go up that dang ladder. All right. Here. All right, see that treasure up there? <laughs> treasure here. Yeah. Black hole. Cool. All right. Let's go back. Um. I think I'll have to end the episode here, though. <laughs> Gotta get to sleep. Sleep is very nice. I love the way it looks. Like it's like this, that faded effect. It's really nice. It's like a dream sequence or something. Okay. Well, that door's gone, but there's a door up here. Yeah, I have to go back. Damn it. <laughs> it sucks, because there's a save point up ahead if I beat a boss, but I don't have time, so. Ah, gee, now I need to go back this way. Wow, I didn't I swear, that was crazy. Like, I kept running into every single one, every single one of those, um, what are they called? Those, uh, these Cupid guys. But I didn't run into a single one of those, um, well, I want to run to this guy anyway. Yeah, didn't run into a single one of those ghost, those huge ghost guys, but these little guys I can't seem to avoid for some reason. It's pissing me off. I'm gonna run away, and hopefully it works. I don't want if I uh, like. I'm really just trying to get to the back of the save point. I'll start the next episode up there instead of back at the <laughs> save point. You know, like an asshole. Yeah, goddamn it, I can't. I can't avoid- you can't avoid these guys, it's bullshit. Alright, let's kill them. Jesus. Fucking pain in my ass. Well, at least there's less guys this time. Yeah, um... I don't know, I feel so tired right now. I don't know how people do it. All this work. Today, boss was like, because everybody, you know, I don't know, doesn't really care that much, you know what I mean? I mean, it's not like a high paying job or anything. And nobody there really, I mean, I guess some people do care, but most people don't that much. And, uh, like the way, you know, manager was talking about, oh, you guys need to stop being so blah all the time and, you know, work harder and stuff. And I'm just like, like, I am so fucking tired. So. Like, I just don't care when they <laughs> say stuff like that. I don't bring it up, like. Because they're just gonna argue with you and I just waste more fucking time, you know what I mean? It just seems weird to me that they do that. But. Yeah. I mean, I just don't care. I don't, I don't see how anyone would. How would you care about something like that? Like, I just don't understand. I mean, yeah, you care about your job, but just not that job, you know. Um, pay me, you know, ten times more. Hell yeah, I don't care so much. Maybe, but I'll still be tired. Like it's not gonna change. No matter how much you pay me, it's not gonna make me not tired. And you know what I mean? You tell me to work hard. Well, if I work hard today, I'm gonna be more tired tomorrow, and the tireder I am tomorrow, the more pissed you're going to be that I'm not working hard tomorrow, so, you know, you gotta balance that shit out, oh, yeah, Ugh, I, I hate this part, I think it looks really cool, but the way it's designed, you can't avoid most of these fucking enemies, it's like a pain in my ass, like, see, right here, there's no way to avoid this enemy right here, just go, stop following me, okay, See, the way he walks, like, he only sits in this little circle, and if you're not... There. Oh, jeez. So you can, like, you can avoid these ones because there's another circle beside him, but the ones with just circles and, like, two... It's just one circle with two ladders. You can't avoid them for, because their hitbox or whatever it is is so huge. Oh, God damn it! Okay. I don't even know why I'm recording this part, but since I'm going to have to do it anyway, I might as well. 
Oh, next time I won't. Show me walking back up there. I'll just be up there. No point in wasting time like that. Alright, well. <laughs> this is Surge Horse, and uh, next time we'll continue. We'll fight a boss. We'll get to a new save point. Uh, we'll get um, Ultra Nova, I think, for a kid. So, that'll be cool. Um, so, yeah. See you later, guys.